Hello and good Monday. Good Monday afternoon, beloved. How are you today? I'm Monica Hill. Welcome to my channel. And if you're not new, welcome back. <clears throat> Last year on my channel on Mondays, I talk about I talked about books and business on Tuesdays, do-it-yourself projects. Wednesdays, my hair journey to grow my hair all the way to waist length. Thursday, music and poetry. Friday, fun fitness challenges. Saturday, inspiration, fuel or spiritual food. And on Sundays, my vegan journey. I started this channel because simply I wanted God to use me. And even though I didn't get a lot of subscribers, I'm still here. My subscribers are growing and I'm thankful for that. But until God tells me to stop making videos, I'll be making videos like it's my job. I put my suit jacket on today and my pearls and took my plaits down, four plaits. This is just what works for me so I could make this video. And then I'm getting back to work. This year, I will be talking more about survival, survival skills, and things that we need to be doing so that we can survive when things get really bad and just things that we should know. I have a couple of other channels. My story time channel for children is where I will be teaching from my children's coloring and activity book titled, I Can. It is available on Amazon and Ingram Spark. And I hope to make it available on Amazon in an ebook soon so that it will be easily accessible. But on that channel, I will be finishing teaching about African American history and also lessons from my book. And right now for the month of March, I am teaching sign language alphabet letters A through Z. And then on another channel of mine called Kung Fu Fighter, which I have not uploaded a video in a while, is where you will see another side of me. You get to see me interview people who inspire me. So I know how to be professional and speak proper grammar. I also know how to be a kid and have fun. And then I know how to just be myself on this channel and just be free to be me. But I wanna share with you today a little bit about business. So I will still, maybe I'll still do some of the topics that I would normally do on certain days of the week and add in some survival methods and techniques. And I can't forget about God. The purpose of me starting this channel is that I asked God, I said, Lord, you've been so good to me. So if you get tired of hearing about God, I'm sorry, this is not the place for you. This is not the channel for you. But if you know you need God, and I don't have it all together, so God is allowing me to share some of my successes or methods of success, and he's helping me to grow. And so if you don't see anything wrong with growing and knowing, this is the place for you, okay? So... I just want to share in this short video, the rest for the rest of this video, some things about business and a book. This book right here, the Holy Bible, the Holy Bible is everything that we need, everything that we need to prosper, to thrive, to survive to rebound, to overcome. Everything that we need is in that book. It talks about money management. Years ago, I used to listen to Dave Ramsey and he used scripture to teach how to be successful in business. He was a millionaire, he lost it all, and then he recovered and he became a millionaire again. There are so many people that God has blessed me during this time of my life who are teachers to me, who don't even know. Some of them may not even know because I've never spoken with them personally, and then some of them do know. I am so grateful for these people. I'm so grateful. And I just wanna say as far as business is concerned, 
I give resources. I'm going to give you one resource. Money with Ebony Dion. I think I missed a word, but if you type in Ebony Dion, Money with Ebony Dion on YouTube, this lady, I believe she's an attorney, she gives out grant information religiously on her channel. She is always giving out information if you're a business owner, if, even if you're not a business owner and you want to increase things like your credit score. She's always giving out information and she's starting a patron. That means you pay to get extra information because she comes across so many different grants. Sometimes she explains that she doesn't have enough time to give out the information in the form of a video before the deadline is up. That's, that's an excellent resource if you're into entrepreneurship, if you want to have your own business, if you're looking for funds for free money, grant money, and you just need a resource. And I want to give a shout out to Chick or Chic Naturel. She's on YouTube. I watched a video of hers last night and um, she, in one of her videos, was buying her dream car. I want to say this about money management and about business. There are people who are working hard behind closed doors so that they can have things, so that they can obtain their dreams. Sometimes it gets hard to get inspired to do things, even around our homes. I don't have it all together. Today I'm working really hard and I've just gotten back on board with a special project and it took me a while to get motivated. Sometimes we get burnt out. If you get burnt out, take a break, but you still have bills to pay. And so as I'm getting back on this bandwagon, it's, I'm getting more and more encouraged. So I wanna encourage you, if there is something, if there is a business, if there's even just your house, how you run your house, or something that you have been trying and you keep failing, well, Abraham Lincoln failed so many times. Get back up. You can do it. We can do it. You have to have purpose, first of all. Make sure that it is something that God is wanting you to do. And then if you need a break, take a break. Reset and get back going. So I'm trying to continue to eat vegan and sometimes I mess up. Well, this morning, I have something that I like, cream of wheat. Something cream of, like cream of wheat. Sorry, it's afternoon, but I'm just now getting to eat breakfast. I have an Impossible Burger. I just put in my air fryer. And I have a little bitty, looks like tangerine, so orange. And this is what I'm going to eat for my breakfast. And I want to tell you all, too, this nutrition drink that I was using to help when, my, when I was caring for my brother is an excellent source of nutrition. It's vegan. So Kate Farms, I believe it's number one on the market. They have excellent nutrition shakes. I just happened to taste one one day and I thought, wow, I can do this. It tastes nice. And these are plain, so they have different flavors. But back to business, be encouraged. You can make it. You can get back into whatever it is that you know you should be doing. And if you maybe shouldn't be doing, maybe that's why it's not working out. But it gets tiring sometimes, but that's okay. Once you start seeing your success, once you start working on a budget or getting out of debt, and you see, you gather your information, and it looks depressing because it's more than what you can handle. But then you start working on a strategy, and then you start your wheels start to turn, and God will bless you. Remember to pay your tithe and offering. My video is about to cut off, and I feel like I haven't said enough or really what I want to say. But the main thing is use resources. There are millions of people on YouTube, seems like. You can't listen to everybody. You can't be pulled all different type of directions. What works for some people might not work for you. Tune in to God. Ask him for direction. He will show you. Fast and pray. Even with your uh, vegan journey, if you get off track, start to fast. So I'm fasting now for a 30-day period to reset because I've messed up. When it comes to your business, if you don't do it, no one else will. Be encouraged. You can make it.